hey guys what's up welcome back to the channel welcome to another vlog today's actually wednesday we're starting to vlog today on a wednesday which is totally fine because who's keeping track anymore and my camera's about to die um but i just wanted to come and tell y'all that i took off yesterday because i wasn't feeling well and i'm back today and i can't find my computer mouse i don't know where these kids did with it but they're gonna get it like i'm gonna ask like they know not to touch my hey guys what's up welcome back to the channel um, I think I try to open up the vlog and my camera died when I was at work the other day, but I was telling y'all that I didn't go to work the day before because I wasn't feeling well and then I came back and I couldn't find my mouse. I ended up finding my mouse like nobody touched it. It was in my eyesight the whole time. Like I just wasn't looking right. Anyway, today's Saturday, so it's a couple days later. Um we're about to go on the road. Yeah, so um I mean, I know it's just something that's off about my hair. I think I'm gonna put on the wig lean, but me nah, I take it off. So anyway, guys, I'll catch y'all on the road when we're actually doing something and not just me trying to yippity yap yap. I should bring snacks for the road because the girl is seriously on her diet. So I'm gonna bring this apple. Wait me. I'm gonna slice it up because I hate biting into an apple. Like I really do. Like not my thing jam so i'm gonna slice this up and put it in something and then i'm gonna catch y'all on the road sunday night super bowl sunday night everybody's downstairs watching the super bowl I'm just not a fan like i'm not that i'm not a fan but i don't watch football on a regular so i'm not too stoked about the super bowl because um i'm from philly so naturally i would love for the eagles to win but good luck to whatever like you know but anyway y'all just saw me do my hair in the montage of the beginning of this video i'm basically prepping for work for the week usually i'm gonna get up in the morning and get ready for work type of person but when i do that i look a mess meaning i'll just like do the bare minimum to make my way out of the house but for this year i want to be intentional of like showing up for myself and being presentable and everything like that so one thing that i've adopted into my routines for 2023 is just prepping for work like on a sunday and probably by wednesday or so i do need to like you know fix my wig again because i've been working out a little bit more so um i sweat a lot at the gym and everything like that so just in my hair i braided it actually because in the morning when it's dried i could just take it out and the curls would be so beautiful i love this unit i don't remember where i got this unit from if i remember i'll link it down below it was like a sponsored content like maybe last year sometime but this is one of the best curly hairs that i've ever received i just don't remember what company it's from i have not done my lashes in a minute and that's because your girl has entered <laughs> a new phase of like wanting to learn how to do my own lashes and i actually one of my students taught me i saw her the other day came to school and her lashes were so beautiful and i'm just like oh my gosh she's like i did it myself i say you, you gotta teach me and she's like one of my girls that like you know we have a good relationship so i was like all right you gotta teach me so she sent me what to order on amazon order those and everything so she she stayed back after school last week um and taught me how to do it and i did a set you know i plucked them out because i used hair glue the glue that i ordered was hurting my eye so i just been using hair glue i use hair glue for my regular strips and that's what I'm going to use tonight. If you have your opinions about hair glue, keep it for now. <laughs> if you have any alternative on, like, you know, like, lash glue. Not strip lash, but, like, not individuals either. But, like, cluster la um, lashes, please let me know. I bought this lash set. And as you can see, I use some. And as you can see, I use some out of it already. Because, like I said, I was practicing and I did my, my eyes last week. Um, and then I got these tools from Amazon to apply my lashes. I'll have these linked down below if you're interested. Um, watch a bunch of TikTok, watch a bunch of YouTube. I'm not the professional, but what I'm able to do will still give me that oomph to my face that what I'm looking for. So look at my lashes before. So 
I'm back. I turned the light on so y'all can really see it a little better. Um, remember, I am no lash tech, but this is what I was able to do. They're still drying, so if you see, like, you know, anything out of the ordinary, that's what that is. But, yeah, you see, it does a little something for my face. Like, I don't want to brush them if they're not dry yet, but, ooh, I feel like I need to fill in more into this one. This one looks a little bit more fuller. Do I add la beginner lash tech on my resume or no? <laughs> Psych, I'm playing. It feels so like self-sufficient. Like I could do all these things I've been spending all this money on. Like obviously it's not the same quality and it's not gonna be, you know, the same. This is my second time doing my lashes. So can you imagine when I practice and I keep practicing, I keep practicing? <laughs> They're gonna be like, where you get your your lashes done at? And I'm like, me, can you do mine now? Because I'm the type of person I can only do my hair and I can only do my nails and I can only do like stuff on me. I haven't practiced on like people to do stuff, so I don't know like how to do stuff on people. So like when I do stuff on people, I'm like oh do it on me, and I'm like I can't. Not because I don't want to, but because I really can't. But hey guys, good morning. I just got back from the gym. Um, I told y'all that today we have a later start for work so it's currently 8 55 so i gotta be in work in like the next hour or so um <clears throat> gym was great today like i need this late start to work every single day like if they just make this one tweak like work-life balance will be a little bit more manageable i don't know why people feel like traditionally they have to do the same thing that they always do let me not even open that can of worms because that I could that's a debate topic that I can go on forever and ever about like COVID showed us that a lot of things can be done virtually I'm not saying teaching virtually because absolutely not I'm not a fan however it also taught us like work-life balance and that is important on how to you know do different things and we're just still stuck in this mindset and I just hate that for us but anyway um I saw this protein shake on what is it on tiktok that i wanted to try and i wanted to show y'all as well now i did tweak the ingredients a little bit because um she added greek yogurt to it so i'm not a fan um and also banana i don't have any bananas i'm really not a fan of bananas either so you know it's not that big of a deal i'll substitute something in um yeah <laughs> It's like a milkshake so i feel guilty having this early in the morning but i'm gonna have it hey guys so it's lunchtime and i'm at work and i'm so ticked off like i don't know the hardest thing about teaching one of the hardest thing about teaching is caring more than students do <laughs> I feel like I really want like I have this one section of kids that I'm really 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 struggling with like struggling with since August and we've tried different things and some days are better than others but like consistently all the other classes have gotten better except this one and I'm just not sure what to do and I had a real talk conversation with them last week and I was like starting this week like we're gonna be on it it's just like some care but I feel like the majority of them in that classroom right now just like don't want to work and don't want to do it and they have excuses for everything and i'm just like y'all this is so frustrating like one i'm not going nowhere i feel like they're used to some teachers quitting on them like this group they had a lot of teachers quit on them and i was like i'm not going anywhere like i want y'all to succeed i'm showing up every day and i'm like i know y'all don't see all the work that i put in but just know i'm working behind the scenes because i really want y'all to succeed i just need y'all to meet me halfway or give me y'all full potential and i'm just talking like you know have to after high school is just 
all the social and wanting to be the class clown none of that's gonna really matter because it's gonna come down to what are you gonna do with the rest of your life and stuff like they're just having a real conversation with them and like they're always so receptive about it and then two minutes later it's just like back to square one so i got frustrated and i didn't yell or anything i just the dean was right there so he's just stepped in my room while i go take a walk to just like breathe but it's getting really frustrating because it's lunchtime. Um, I wanted to show y'all what I so I always <laughs> bring this for lunch. At least my lunch bag. Let me show y'all what's in there. Overnight oats with chia seeds and almond milk. I got some fruit. Please bring lunch just in case I'm like hungry. Like this is supposed to be breakfast, but I always bring lunch just in case I get hungry, and I never really do. So I'll always end up eating this for dinner. But this is broccoli and chicken, and it's fried chicken, y'all. Don't judge me. My batteries are about to die, and I did not bring my extra battery. So I'll catch y'all later. I just wanted to show y'all what I'm about to eat my oats right now, and I probably don't eat anything else until I get home because we go home in the next like hour and a half. So. This should hold me over and i did finish my protein shake well it's a little bit in there my protein shake and i'm just gonna drink water always stay hydrated hey y'all so i'm home tomorrow's valentine's day i went to dollar tree to go buy a whole bunch of candy because i want to like make little baggies for all my students so that all of them can get one of them even though they get on my nerves i still love them at the end of the day so i, I do want to buy i buy these i bought these little baggies from dollar tree it's 25 in a pack it's supposed to be like the birthday ones but they work and i buy i bought pink they didn't have any other colors pink and purple and i wanted like a different color for the like the boys and stuff but i just decided to do one color because that's all they had and purple bought a bunch of candy like that that's in wrappers so when i open them i'm not touching that candy no so i bought this to buy out for them so yeah. Hey Kai, say hello. You gonna be my little helper? Come. just made these on canva i found this on the internet it's like an equation it's so crazy because this is exactly what we're learning right now it ends with i love you um so yeah it's corny but it works so i'm gonna print these and cut them up and because the bags already are being wrapped i'm just gonna staple the note on there tomorrow oops all right guys mission complete i got all of them in this big grocery bag and oh did i show y'all and these are the notes i just cut up and then tomorrow when i get to work i'll staple them onto each bag so i'll give them after i collect their exit ticket i'll give them on their way out so they're like getting it and leaving because i don't want no rappers in my room <laughs> leah yeah but anyway i'm gonna call it a night so i'll catch y'all tomorrow hey guys what's up happy valentine's day happy day of love if you celebrate it um so i just got home from work i'm really not doing anything today because Swiss is at work we're gonna do something this weekend um but right now i'm heading to the gym i just got home and i got changed let me show y'all what i'm wearing to the gym i wanted to do like a get dressed with me but my camera was downstairs and i was already like in the process so leggings from amazon 
the cake is caking, okay? I got this little like active wear top from Ross. I'm just have like a sports bra underneath. And that's what I'm wearing to the gym. And my sneakers are out there. Um, but pretty much today is strength day. So it's going to be a lot of lifting and all of that. Um, I don't really buy the sets from Amazon just because like... I don't really buy the sets from Amazon just because like how my bust area is. The sets don't really like, you know, add up. And I'm not that comfortable with just wearing like sports bra in the gym just yet. Um, So this is kind of what I wear. I don't always wear long sleeve. I'm just doing it today because it's kind of, you know, it's still cold in in the area so winter and then i'll since i'm lifting and i won't be sweating as much i'm just wearing this um so yeah i'm excited i love lift days like i'm more excited for strength days than um cardio like i wasn't gonna i didn't feel like going today i'm like oh today's strength i like strength days tomorrow yesterday was cardio and tomorrow's cardio today's strength so i'm excited um but i just wanted to check in the kids love their little gift bag they're like oh we love you like y'all love me like you love me whatever so they were pretty excited about that like and i did it based so when i have the class i'll give it to them so the kids who saw the other kids that had class before them they were like we didn't get any candy you don't love us but i was just like y'all didn't have my class yet so after everybody got my class they were like pretty excited um so yeah anyway i am about to head out i'm stalling as well because i'm well my watch is green now it's charged a little bit so I was waiting on my watch to be charged. I should be listening. I just peed. Today's Valentine's Day. Why am I not like listening to like love music? <laughs> I'm just a gangster at heart. <laughs> I shouldn't really be listening to some love song, but me at school, I'm a really not no love song from my phone. You know what is this? No sir. No, this bad to bad. Is this a love song? I mean, get me. Would you believe me if I told you? All I want you to know is me the same without you, darling. Baby, let me be here for you. Appreciate all you guys. I know it's dark and I know y'all can't see me, but... I am on the verge of crying. Like, today was such a shitty day. Like teaching is one of the most difficult things i've ever done and like i am a tough teacher like i can take a lot and this year has been one of the most difficult years for me it started out very rocky and i've been using like you know i've been just make trying to make the best of it but today today drained me today i was very i cried today and i felt like i was at my breaking point i was ready to give up um thankfully i have an amazing team that just like you know we get it and we support each other and we're real af like <sighs> i even have some of my kids text me like hey hamilton are you okay like we heard um this one kid was just like these kids are not worth it for real like we love you and we appreciate you and don't let them bring you down or something like that and <sighs> At the end of the day, I know why I do what I do, but some days are just so difficult, especially when teachers have this unrealistic, like, goal. I feel like we have, we get so much stuff added to our plates daily and we are the expectation for us is just so high and we do what we can and if the data isn't showing what it needs to it's just like you know what are you doing and i know how much i put into my work and it's a lot i've spent hours like you know 
and it's my job i'm not looking for sympathy i'm just opening up to y'all to show y'all like the reality of everything because y'all know me i'm gonna keep it real regardless y'all gonna see the good the bad and the ugly and like i know i always get questions about becoming a teacher and all of that and y'all literally it is difficult i'm not even gonna sugarcoat it some days obviously there are way more better days but like the low days are very low and like today i was i was ready to just like leave i just feel like screaming just like at the top of my lungs and then i also have to regulate myself before i get home you know because I have Kai and he needs his mommy and he needs good energy. Like, but oh my God, like today's one of those days that I'm really struggling to like leave work at work and leave the emotions at the door. Oh my gosh. Like school ended probably three and a half hours ago and I'm still in this rut. I'm still feeling... Anyway, guys, I'm going to talk to y'all later, probably tomorrow, because I need to relax. In the party, he just want to rump. Big boobs in the bus, they plump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like, I tell you, always stay hot. Oh, they mad because I keep making bops. Oh, she mad because I'm taking her spot. If I was, I'd me a lot. Like damn, she in her mood. 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 She lit, get money too. Like damn, she in her mood. No friends, I don't with the fake. Saying they love me, but one in my place. Step in the party, I'm looking the baddest. So the paparazzi in my face. Pretty. I came from the gutter, said I'd be lit by the end of the summer And I'm proud that I'm still getting bigger Going viral is dead, I'm sicker Like what, let's keep it a buck It's too boring, I'm stuck in a rut Let me get me wrong when I hop at the chug It's like Lauren with a ass butt, yup Pretty face and a waist all gone And I'm making them way hold on And I'm making them way hold on Way hold on